In this day and age, it would be extremely rare to die from an acoustic neuroma. It's actually almost unheard of. I guess historically, patients may have died from acoustic neuromas if they get too big and compress the outflow of spinal fluid from the brain. Uh, nowadays, with modern MRIs, we diagnose tumors when they're much smaller and we can manage them at an easy size to handle. In addition, we have modern microsurgical techniques and modern radiosurgical techniques. These are very delicate and focused approaches to carefully manage tumors, even uh, tumors when they're extremely large in size. In this day and age, patients should not die of an acoustic neuroma.